like my man Girl, how you shake it? Gotta play a life It's a cold act moment Let me go and get my camera All I wanna know is Please, please join us because Renata's telling me about Marlena, Marlena Dietrich, right? Yeah. Or you show uh, your neck or things yes. like this. That's submission in the feminine part. And, and so photographers probably, mm -hmm. uh, still photographers mm -hmm. in particular, mm -hmm. yeah. they understand yes. body language because yes. they know what sells. Yes, yes, exactly. And it's very often intuitive. And it should be. Uh, when you're talking about body language... What about emotion? What what kind of what kind of communication is conveyed emotionally through body language? Uh, fear, uh, humor, um, honesty, sadness, anger. What about those things? Uh, being attracted. All that you see in facial expressions. You can tell, you can also tell on the rest of the body. Don't just judge one part of the body, just a face or just a, a look or so. Make sure you judge the rest of the body as well. Because maybe with my eyes and my face, I say, I really like you, which is definitely not serious. But maybe you think I meant it yet. If you know body language, you can tell that was fake. So you want to really know a little bit more about it. Watch the rest. Is the rest saying I like you or is it not? Women seem to be better at this than men. Yes. Uh, is it just because they take a little bit more time? I, in, a, in a cocktail lounge, let's yes. not say a bar, but in yeah. a cocktail lounge where a, a lot of young single men and women congregate uh, to meet one another. Mm -hmm. And they're checking everybody out, right? It seems that women do a little more checking yeah. than guys. The guy spots somebody over here, mm -hmm. wow, what a looker, that's it, mm -hmm. boom. Mm -hmm. I'm in with a really stupid line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, women, I think, have a lot more intuition to, oh, really? to observe body language. I think so, definitely. It has also been researched, yes, with MRIs, that women are a lot more intuitive. Uh, also, women have peripheral vision they can check you over from top to toe without doing this like men do men have tunnel vision so they literally have to look into your eyes and then go down and back up which we sometimes will linger <laughs> in various no. areas right no. <laughs> but now no, yeah. women women are at least <laughs> I, I can't say accused because that sounds negatively. Uh, but they they are um, uh, they are described mm -hmm. as butt lookers. Mm -hmm. That women, whereas guys are looking mm -hmm. at breasts mm -hmm. and they're looking Legs. at uh, some of the other interesting yes. parts, that that women generally are taking a look at how tight a guy's rear end is. Mm -hmm. Is that true? That's true, yes. Well, what, why? What, is that, what does that mean? I think it's attractive to see a man with a nice round little behind. Tush. Derriere. Tush is cute. Derriere, derriere. is very, See, yes. there again. There again. <laughs> we say butt and the French say derriere, you know. <laughs> it's a whole different culture. Yeah. Um, women can study body language and use it themselves to be attractive, right? Yes, actually body language, there are some things you can learn in using, but normally body language is something you do automatically. It is not something learned, and therefore it is the true interaction with other people. You can tell if somebody is fakey or not. So the learned body language is not the real body language. If somebody really tries to be sexy or feminine or something like this, then you can tell. But if it's the true body language, then you really know the feelings behind. Uh, is the person honest? Does the person want to meet the other person? Or does she just pretend she wants to meet him and then turn around and okay, say, well, oh, we'll, gee. We've we'll got a couple of minutes left. So uh, give us a lesson on the, the do's and don'ts. Uh, even if it isn't a matter of learning somebody else's body language mm -hmm. and trying mm -hmm. to apply it to themselves, mm -hmm. tell us some of the do's, the mm -hmm. things that work, the things that you can concentrate mm -hmm. on, mm -hmm. and some of these don't ever do this if you want to meet anybody. Yeah, yeah. Well, I would say the do's are 
if you want to meet somebody, like you said, in a lounge. We're in the lounge. In okay. the lounge, We're yes. So maybe you have an eye contact, which is a little prolonged. Maybe you move your shoulders a little forward. Uh, maybe you put out your legs in a sexy way. Uh, if you have shoes on, which with no heel, you usually flip the shoe up and down. That is very sexy. Oh, the heel flipping mm -hmm. is a sign yes, the heel, all of a sudden? Absolutely, yeah. i got to wear more loafers. Yeah. <laughs> And you show your wrist. If you're a woman, you show your wrist a little more. You touch your neck. You show a part of your neck a See, little now, more. See, if a guy does that, automatically he's effeminate, though, right? Yeah, yeah, we think we, so. We, but yes. we make those generalities. Yes. Yes. It may be a terribly heterosexual yeah. guy, but if he has mannerisms yes. like that, yeah. automatically yeah. we this make was assumptions. Just for women, yes. Men usually put their chest out more, stand yeah. up more erect erect, uh, walk a little more masculine, have a bigger stance, make themselves a little bigger. Women make themselves a little... What are the don't do's? The don't do's. Um, if you talk too loud, if you uh, giggle too uh, much, if you laugh too much, then it's a show rather than real interest. And men or somebody would sense that. Uh, what do guys do that really they should stop doing because mm -hmm. it bugs almost all women. Mm -hmm. If they take that stance with their legs really wide apart, oh, the wide I stance. think I think that is <laughs> too showy. Because if a man is good looking, you know it. And you see it. You don't need that extra little demonstration. Funny. You I just, just know it. I just saw an album cover, a CD cover mm -hmm. of a rock and roll group, yeah. and it's a very virile, masculine yeah, yeah. rock and roll group. And the yeah. guy in front, the lead singer, yeah. his legs are yes. like this. Yes. Yeah, he looks yes. like a, a V, yes. uh, inverted. Exactly. And see, now, mm -hmm. if I run into him, I'm going to say, <laughs> You'll tell him. Yes. phony guy, because <laughs> Renata said so. There you go. Which Renata? Renata <laughs> Boucher. This is the Pat McMahon Show. <laughs> Thank you.